Welcome back to another video. My name is Aaron and I help people expand their consciousness. Now in this video, I'll be sharing with you the most powerful way to remove limitations to get what you want in life. Now, this video will help you see your blind spots in knowing that you can question the limitations that you place upon yourself and how that can radically transform the kind of results you get because then you can open up new opportunities. Now me for example, I have noticed that a lot of times the limitations I have are just self-perpetuated. I just simply think they're there. And the way that I move through that is I learn how to question my thought process and how to get outside of my own head and see it from a new point of view. Now, the limitations we have are based upon blind beliefs that we have about the way the world works. It's the model for the way we see the world. And the most powerful way that I have found to move through those limitations is to change my self image for the kind of person that I am. Now the most powerful way that I was able to change my self image recently is most likely just changing my work ethic. No, I changed my work ethic from somebody that was just kind of casually had one foot in and one foot out with trying to achieve my goals. And what I did was is I placed all my energy into that knowing that the more action I took, the more that that changed the way that I saw myself. And then what happened is everything began to change because I started to see myself as a completely new person and that allowed me to really get into unfamiliar territory which is where a lot of the benefit lies. You could think of it like this, the more we repetitively do the same things day in and day out, the more we think the same thoughts, take the same actions, even have the same habits, the more we recreate that reality which is very predictable. The thing with predictability is while it might feel good because we know what's going to happen so we feel safe, at the same time nothing new can happen and we aren't able to remove those limitations because that's just a part of the way the world works. So really the power of this video is doing something you've never done before and questioning the kind of thoughts that you have. If there's something that you say then think could I do that and you look and the mind starts to come pop in and say no you can't question it and say why do I think I can't do it well I think I can't do it because I haven't done it before or because one time I did this scary thing and something bad happened when you start to question those thoughts that's when you can start to then take action and there's also something called the five second rule by Mel Robbins and it's what you do is anytime there's something you know you should be doing you just count down five four three two one and you just simply do it that doesn't let those negative thoughts come in that you have to question and it turns you also into somebody with the self image of someone that just takes action. So the idea behind this is to either question the negative thoughts that say you can't do something and then to reframe it into somebody that actually can or just to straight up do it and say 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and when you do 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 it focuses your mind more on something than the questions of can I or can I and you get out of the analytical mind and into somebody that just simply does. So understand that this process is as simple as having a vision for who you prefer to be and asking yourself if everything that I prefer to be, if this end goal of after six months of the perfect version of myself, if I were able to get that and there were no limitations, what kind of actions would I have? If I knew I wasn't going to get rejected, what kind of actions would I take? You see, as you ask yourself better questions, your brain starts to look for better answers and you'll start to create in your mind a new sense of opportunity. You see, if you knew that you could reach out to people that had already done what you wanted to do and under the old limitations, you'd say that person would never reach out to me, that person wouldn't reply to me, you see you won't even take action to begin with. But you'll be surprised when you start to develop the kind of mentality that's really relentless. You know that you can take action 
action and you start to develop a new level of self-confidence for yourself. If you are a painter and the idea is you want to be able to do it for a living, reach out to other people that do it for a living and ask if you can work with them for a day, if you can add value to them. Start to open up some type of dialogue, whether it's email or going into the business and talking to that person. Under the old limitations, that's something that's a no-no because it's not within the kind of uh, common thoughts, common actions and habits that you might have. But as you start to question those, as you start to reframe the possibilities, everything begins to change. As you get outside of yourself and what is safe, you will open up opportunities then start to see it from a completely new point of view. So remember, all you have to do to remove limitations is to either question the thoughts that say you can't do something and reframe it, or to 54321 it and just to simply do it. To start to see the end picture of what you want to create and knowing that if you could do anything and not get rejected and everything were to work out, what could you begin to do and to take massive action in that direction, not become identified if little hiccups come and certain people do reject you, but having that relentless type attitude and knowing that that will change your self image, you will literally start to view you yourself as a completely new person and everything will then begin to change. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Feel free to like this video if you liked it, subscribe if you haven't already, and as always, I will see you guys on the next vid. Peace, much love, namaste. All right, bye.